right, it's Miss Scarf. Today we're going to learn how to make marshmallow forkies from Toy Story. We'll need four pipe cleaners for the arms, four lollipop craft sticks, four marshmallows, um, blue food colouring for the mouth and red for the eyebrow. Then we are going to make our own fondant eyes. So you need fondant white icing that I'm going to use a nozzle to make and black food colouring for the middle of the eyes. We'll also need six squares of chocolate. Then we'll break them up and put them into a bowl, ready to melt and put over for later. Then you will need a teaspoon of icing sugar in your bowl and we're going to mix it with a tiny bit of water just to make the blue. So you can mix it together. If it goes too liquidy you can get a bit more icing sugar and put that into your mixture so you can get another spoonful. And then you add the blue, a drop of the blue food colouring into here. So you need to mix it all in and then it goes a nice blue colour ready to go for the mouth. You need to do the same for the red with the icing sugar, a bit of water and a tiny bit of red food colouring to get the red for the eyebrow. You need to get your marshmallow and snip the top of it to make Forky's head. So you chop little sections of it out like that and then just get rid of that bit of marshmallow. And again, you probably need to do about two or three snips in the top. Then his head will look like that and we're going to chop the other three to make all the heads for Forky. Again, you need to snip the pieces off like that to make the fork shape on his head. So that was two done. We're going to do two more. Just making little snippets in the head. Be careful not to cut your fingers. Again, you could get a grown-up to help you with this part. Now you've cut the Forky's heads like that, you need to get your stick and poke it into the back bit. Like that, so that it stays on. Then you get your second one and poke that one onto the stick. So it sits on slightly like that. Now it's time to make the fondant icing eyes. So you need to uh, um, bit squash down onto here. And then you need to keep a bit to the side for the black icing, to, for the middle of the eye. Then you get your piping nozzle and you make a circle and then push it out with your finger like that. So we need to make eight eyes because we're making four forkies. And then two more. So you have your eight eyes here, and then now we are going to mix this with a tiny bit of black icing. So if you get a spoon and just get a tiny bit on the end of it into your icing like that, and then you can just squish it into it and it will eventually all turn black. Don't worry if it goes on your hands, it does wash off. So you keep squishing until it's all the same colour going to make the black centre of the eye so you need a tiny piping nozzle and then you're going to do the same as you did with the white and pop them out with your finger again and then you push it onto the white eye like this it's quite a fiddly job so then that, that makes it onto there and we're going to get another one have eight eyes ready to go on the forky so if you pick them up your chocolate is melted it should look like that and it is ready to dunk your forky into so you cover it in white chocolate and then you can put it back on the plate to dry just set and then you do the next one and you make sure they're all fully covered in white chocolate You've got two more to do, so make sure they're all covered. Oops. And then your last one. Then you need to wait for them to set before you can put any icing on, all the eyes. So if you just leave them on a plate, and then they can set. Pretty much set, it's time to put the eyes on. So you need to get two eyes, 
and put them on top of each one. Leave a bit of space at the top ready to draw the eyebrow on. And there you have four forkies with their eyes on. Put the two different colours that we mixed up into different piping bags with a thin nozzle in each one. We're going to start off with the red eyebrow just above the eyes and it is just a little thin squiggle. Okay, so then you do all four like that. Then the next one and the last one here. There we go, we have four eyebrows done and then you need your blue one to do the mouth. And then you need to wait for the icing to dry and then it's time to put your pipe cleaner arms now on. Now the forkies have set, it's time to put the arms on. So you need to wrap a pipe cleaner around the middle bit, probably wrap it around twice so it stays on and in place. And then you need to twist the arms at the end into little hands a forky. And then twist this hand as well. To a little arm shape, okay? Here are your finished forkies. Hope you enjoy making them.